It's Nat and Essie plus Sprinkles the Bear. <laughs> Hello Bessies, Essie here and today we are going to color Paw Patrol Moto Pops. So here we have three markers. We have red, we have yellow, we have blue and on the first page we have Chase and he is riding his awesome motorcycle. And then over here, wait! Who is this? She has some whiskers. Do you guys know who that is? And then over here we have a maze where we can help Sky drive all the way to the finish line. Hmm, why don't we go ahead and do that? Let's get our red marker. Here is our starting point. So we're gonna go here and then right here. And then here, we make a left and then make a right. <gasps> Ta-da! We made it to the finish line. Let's go ahead and color it up. There you go. So the straight line is the correct path and all the dotted lines are just some confusing roads. <laughs> okay, oh, at first I thought this was Chase, but it's actually Marshall. Uh, Marshall's outfit is mostly color red, but it does have a little bit of yellow. So let's get our yellow marker and we'll color the star yellow, the collar, and other little parts of his outfit. Okay, dogs, now we can get our red marker and color the rest of his outfit red. Oh, wait, this is a little bit of yellow too. And now we continue. Almost done! Now let's get our blue marker and we are going to color this part blue as well as a little bit of this part. Perfect! And finally, let's get our yellow marker again and finish it all up. Ta-da! All done! Here is Marshall! Roof, roof. I'm on fire! Okay, next up we have Rubble. <gasps> Look, we have five Paw Patrol Pops. Oh, I still don't know the name of this character. But there is Rubble again. <gasps> uh -huh. There's Sky, there's Rubble, there's Chase, and there is Marshall. Here is Sky. Oh, look, it's a puzzle. There's Chase. Oh, there's Sky again. And I think I want to color her this time. So from this reference, it looks like Sky's color right here on the bottom of her outfit is color black. But we don't have color black. But I do have a purple crayon. Let's see if this works. I think it does. So let's use a purple instead of black. it works out perfectly. Now we need a pink marker. And the set doesn't come with a pink marker too, so let's figure something out again. Oh look what I found! A pink marker from a different set. Let's see if it works. I think it works perfectly. Super cool! One last thing to do is color this part yellow. And voila! She's done! Let's take it to the sky! Woof! 
Okay, so we colored Marshall, we colored Sky. Hey, where is Chase? Oh, there he is. Okay, Chase, it's your turn. First thing we want to do is get our yellow marker and color some yellow parts. There's not a whole lot, so I figure this is the best time to do it in the very beginning. And now that the yellow parts are done, let's move on to the black part. But again, we don't have a black marker, so I have here a Sharpie, and I think we're just going to go ahead and use that. <laughs> and hopefully we don't mess it up. Okay, so using a Sharpie here is what we came up with. Um, it's not so bad. <laughs> and thankfully, it didn't bleed through the next page. So now that we got that out of the way, it's time to use our blue marker and color the rest of his outfit blue. Here is Chase, all done. Roof, roof. Chase is on the case. Roof. Next up, we have Marshall and Chase. And then there is Chase again. And that is it for our Crayola Color Wonder coloring book that is mess free. Um, we did an activity, we colored Marshall, we also colored Sky, and of course, Chase. Hello, Bessies, Essie here, and today we are going to color Spidey and his amazing friends. So, we have some markers here. We got red, blue, and purple, and look at the first page looks like we have spidey right here so let's get our red marker and let's start coloring and then we have our blue marker for some parts of this outfit And the rest is color red. And here we have Spidey! Oh, and look! Here is all of them! Here is Spidey, here is Spin, and here is Ghost Spider. Let's do it! Let's start with Spidey! Spidey's done, let's move on to Spin. This part of his outfit is color red. This one... Remember, it doesn't have to be perfect. And then everything else is gonna be color black. I said they didn't come with a black marker, but I have one. Ooh, this marker might be a little much. It's a little dark. <laughs> Let's not forget the one on his chest. And that is for spin. And then this part is going to be color purple. And this is going to be color blue. I'm thinking this is kind of her cape, so I'm just gonna go ahead and color this color blue as well. And then everything else, we can color it purple. And now, 
let's reveal their names. Right here on the cloud, there's Ghost Spider. Here is Spidey. And we're gonna go ahead and use blue for Miles. Also known as Spin. Here's Spidey again. Here is Gwen or Ghost Spider. Here they are, all three of them once again. Another Spidey. Oh, look, it's a puzzle. Do you guys want to color Miles? I think that would be fun. Let's do it. Let's start off with the color red of his outfit. Yay! Here he is! Here is Miles, aka Spin! There's Ghost Spider! Great! Because we've colored Spidey, we've colored Miles, the last thing we want to color is Ghost Rider! Let's do it! We'll start with her mask. Let's get our blue marker because some parts of her outfit is colored blue like the spider logo on her chest. And a little bit right here on the side. I wonder though if we can use this pink marker that I have to create lines and make this a little bit better. Yeah, we actually can. Perfect. Awesome! And let's do the same to her name. Ta-da! Ghost Spider is ready. And finally, we have one more page of Spidey. And that's the end of our activity notebook. Thanks for coloring with me. See you next time. Bye!